Hello and welcome back to our North Carolina Tar Heels Dynasty in NCAA Football 2004. Another doubleheader here tonight. First game, we're going to be taking on the number nine ranked NC State Wolfpack. We are 14th in the nation right now. Both teams 4-0. and oh, This should be a great rivalry matchup. I've been looking forward to this one all night and all day. And I hope you guys have been too. So I got this all shared in the Discord. And we should be good to go. Just close out my YouTube so there's no lag. Load up my YouTube on my phone so I can see the chat. And all you beautiful people out there. Alright. Don't forget to slap that like button while you're here. Appreciate it. It helps the channel out a lot. Make sure that the uh, videos end up in other people's recommendeds that are not subscribed to the channel. It actually makes a huge difference. What's going on, Audrey? How you doing? All right, here's the matchup, the first matchup of the night. Number nine versus number 14. Number 21 defense in the nation for the Wolfpack. We are 11th right now. And the number 22 offense in the land. 83rd rushing attack, 9th passing attack, though. Darian Durant has just been absolutely outstanding. Let's take a look at his stats really quick. Over 1,000 yards, 15 touchdowns, 2 picks. He's already got more touchdowns this season than he had all of last season. And a 70% completion rating. That, that's insane. And he's got 2 rushing touchdowns, almost 100 yards. And it's all a big part of uh, Mike Mason right now. Leads the team in touchdowns with six. He had zero last season in his freshman year. And just one drop on the season as well. And, of course, Bowman leads the team in yards. He is our go-to guy. He seems to be open almost every single play. It's pretty insane. Uh, Mo Ivey, our freshman receiver, 6'5", 193 pounds. He is out for this stream tonight. But we'll be seeing him again on, let's see, what's today? Today is Thursday, so we'll be seeing him again Sunday night. And Darrell Mitchell, Jr., he's got four touchdowns. He's second on the team. And Alex Russell, freshman strong safety, leads the team in tackles with 20. He's got four for loss, which is number one on the team. He's got a sack as well. We need to get more pressure on the quarterbacks if we want to be successful against these better teams. Russell with three picks leads the team. Ferguson has the pick six on the year. Four pass deflections for Holt. Four forced fumbles. I don't think we've recovered a single one this season. No, we have not. So pretty much zero awareness when the ball is on the ground for our defense. Feels real bad. Josh Hunt, two of two in his career so far. King field goals. And Davin Huber, two punts, 89 yards. Really good average, 44.5. And that average needs a little bit of work, but eh, we'll get there. All right. Let's do it. Huge rivalry game in Chapel Hill. Let's go. And we're just going to go with the blue and the white. I'm ready. Who else we got in the chat here? We got... Oh, whoops. There we go. John Jensen, Zachary Joseph, Tyler Rocky. What's going on, everybody? Hope everybody has been having a fantastic week so far. I know with the uh, media outrage, coronavirus, you know, there's really no sports left. But you guys got me, and that's all you need, right? What's up? All right, Tar Heels. Let's get it. How you doing, Tyler? What's going on, buddy? All right, we're kicking it off first. T.A. McClendon back to return. He ran for a bunch of yards on us last season, and he is currently the number one on the Heisman watch list due to the injury to Maurice Claret for Ohio State. And look at that, already off to a great start. Chaos driven in the chat. What's going on, brother? That was a little bit of a late start to the stream, but I had some other stuff going on, so, you know, deal with it. I had to. All right. Uh, I don't believe they have Rivers at court. No, they do not have Phillip Rivers at quarterback anymore. I did not get it onto my guy. Planner will pick up a couple yards to start off the game for the Wolfpack. And they're going to go five wide early in the game. There we go. Finally got to Russell. 
Let's get that win. I'm trying. I really am, Tyler. Second down and eight. And that is deflected across the middle of the field. The Hurricane Junior Senior. What's going on, man? My third down and eight. Just raging on Call of Duty. Sounds terrible. They really need the uh, field of view aspect in that game to be changed because that's just trash. Uh-oh. Nice throw to Washington over the middle. He's always raging on Call of Duty. 100%. That man rages at every single game that he plays. It's in his DNA. He's been like that his whole life. <laughs> NC State has Mario Williams. I'm not sure if he's on the team anymore. He might be. I don't remember if he got drafted or not yet. Deep shot. Picked off by Kirk. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Bunch of ball hawks out here in our secondary. I'm loving it this season. Just a bit of an overthrow. And we're up to 12 viewers. Slap that like button, folks. I love you. All right. Let's see who's in at quarterback. Is Kirby still in there? Why is Kirby still in there? Feels weird. I don't know why it does that. It always did that in this game. It's so irritating to me. So I guess Kirby's going to start the game for some apparent reason. Throw it over the middle. Pollock, nice completion. Kirby is going to be so good. That's with the teaming up crap. You didn't sign up for this? <laughs> Listen, man. I just call it like I see it, all right? I know you, man. I grew up with you. <laughs> Obviously, I'm going to remember you raging. One of my earliest memories of you raging was in uh, James Bond, was it? Uh, 007 Goldeneye. Playing multiplayer with you. <laughs> that was always fun. You get popped in the head across the the map with a pistol and just scream. The good old days. Oh, Greer wide open. Freshman tight end comes down with it at the 20. Let's go. We got to get him a little bit more involved in the offense. He is really good for us. Great catch. And a great throw. open. Pollock. How did he catch that? Oh my goodness. The spinning catch. You gotta love it. First down and goal from the five yard line. We're still 100% in the red zone. You gotta love it. Quick snap. And Durant is going to walk in for his third touchdown of the season. That also gets him over 100 rushing yards. Very good drive for the Tar Heels to start off the ball game. That pump fake just got that defensive tackle to jump. Oh, my goodness. Really good drive from us. Let's see if NC State can answer. It is seven to nothing. Our offense has been clicking all season long. I'm loving it right now. Oh man! Little channel update. We're up to uh, 915 subscribers on the channel, inching our way ever closer to the 1,000 mark. Been grinding since February 10th. 2017. So many loyal subscribers, loyal fans, and made some great friends doing this channel. And it has been a blast. Oh, I should have had that. 
Come on, Russell. You gotta come down with that, brother. I read that perfectly, too. All right, let's go 3-4, a little crash gold. Outside linebacker blitzing. I like it. Come on. Snap the ball. And they're going to go play action. Deep shot left side. And Hall has it. Still going up to the 40-yard line. Good play. My goodness. A great play action. Look at my linebacker. He had no idea where the ball was going. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is terrible. He was lost. He looked like a lost little puppy dog right there. Alright. And they're going to go play action again. Oh, I read that perfectly. I just couldn't jump. What's up, Michael? How you doing, bud? Appreciate you stopping by, as always. And yeah, people are going crazy with the uh, coronavirus outrage. It's a pandemic. It's the plague. We're all going to die. Not really. You got a better chance of dying if you got the flu. My wife had to go and get baby wipes, and it was like the smallest package she could find. It was like stuffed in the back of the the shelves. Like, really, people, if you don't got kids, don't be buying the baby wipes. What's the matter with you? Like, there's people that have kids that actually need those. And you're just going out and just stockpiling stuff because the media told you to. They are 100% on 4th down conversions. 4th down and 9. They're going to go for it. This is pretty crazy. I mean, I probably would have went for it here as well, to be honest with you. And he overthrows his target. That was not a good throw. My goodness. All right. Let's see if we can get our run game going just a little bit here. Okay, Lewis, nice broken tackle. Yeah, because TP is going to save your life, right? <laughs> I don't understand it either. Moore with just four touchdowns, two picks. He has, he's been doing pretty rough <laughs> for the Wolf Pack. Who wants it? He's open. Oh, nice catch. Mike Mason, first down, Tar Heels. Big man is just feeling himself this season. They can't stop him. I don't know why, but NC State just, they haven't tried to run the football, which makes no sense to me. Deep shot, Mike Mason. He's, oh, he dropped it. No. Just the second drop of the season. Man. That would have been huge. Yeah, I don't know why the Wolfpack are not using their, their star running back right now. They're just throwing the ball. Which is really awkward. My ball would get that. Oh, nice deflection. Okay. That was a really good reaction right there. And I think we'll do a little rollout here to the right side, see what happens. We are 80% on third downs. That is insane. <laughs> so much fake news these days. Absolutely, man. Couldn't agree more. Oh, boy. Look at the blocking. Let's go, Durant. I'm not going to get it. Feels bad. I wanted to throw it, but I didn't want to force it and throw a bad pick. I'm going to go for it anyway. We're inside their territory. Why not? All right, let's see. Mitchell's filling in for Mo Ivy. Might hit him across the middle here. We will. Wide open. Where was the coverage? <laughs> I 
<laughs> you only get the news when Bob comes and tells you. <laughs> yeah, the only time I ever hear anything terrible is when my mother comes over. Every time I see my mom, she has to tell me about at least two or three people that died. And I'm just like, really, Mom? I Like, not to sound terrible, but I just don't care. I don't want to hear it. Like, I don't even know these people. Let's go, Lewis. Nice catch for the halfback. Getting him involved in the passing attack. I like it. I'm going to try to find NCAA Basketball 10. Rock out with the Shockers of Wichita State. Those guys are always fun to watch. Yeah, no tourney this year. Insane. Actually insane. All right, Greer's open. I had to get rid of that one quick. Let's go, Greer. Look at the speed burst from the tight end. Okay. Let's go. I don't know what Madison Hedgecock's doing here. He did not block anyone, and he was facing the quarterback. What are you doing, my guy? You're supposed to be, like, the best player on the team, or one of the best. She's the bearer of terrible news, pretty much. As soon as she walks in the door, my mom will go, Hey, did you hear that so-and-so died? I'm like, no, but thank you. I needed that information in my life. I really did. Alright, let's go. Oh, high snap. High snap. We're just going to get rid of it quick. Bowman. Inside the five-yard line. That's going to end the first quarter. We are on top. Seven to nothing. Over our in-state rivals, the NC State Wolfpack. I like it. Does anybody else's mother do that, though? Just tell you about all the people that she knows that died? Second goal from the four-yard line. I didn't hit that button. No! Oh, my goodness. Ugh. Funny story, I hit L2 to bring the passing icons down so I could run. And instead, it didn't register, and then I threw a pick. Feels really bad. There goes our red zone percentage. I'm going to cry myself to sleep tonight. Deep shot left side. He's got him. Oh, he missed, he missed the throw again. Man. I don't know what this quarterback's doing. Left side, Williams. He's dropped after a four yard pickup. They're down in six now. I'm blitzing. Get him. Oh, no. He overthrows his target again. This quarterback is bad. Oh, my goodness. He's overthrown so many open guys. What is his accuracy? Like 60? Gonna audible out of that. I don't like it. I don't feel like having them fake it. Nice kick. Not returnable. All right. Lewis, nice run. Been really impressed with him so far for the first four games. He has played really well for us. If 
Might send Mason on a out or not an out route. A streak here. Safety's playing up a little bit. One on one coverage. Mike Mason. And he's got it inside the 25 yard line. Big Mike. Let's go. Cannot leave a little cornerback one on one with Mike Mason like that. He just can't do it. I don't think raging in Call of Duty is going to make me feel any better. <laughs> okay, Darian. Okay, down to the 60-yard line. What a run. People forget that he can run the football. I snap. Mitchell's wide open for the touchdown. Oh my goodness. That's just several plays where they just didn't even try to cover him. The other one was on fourth down when we converted. I don't know what they're doing. But it's not good. And they're just not trying to run the football, which doesn't make any sense to me. Because they were spamming McClendon last season against us. And I think our passing attack has just been so good this season. I don't know, maybe most of the guys in the secondary just graduated or went to the draft. And these are all new faces. I don't know. only thrown three interceptions. One of them was on accident. <laughs> there you go, McClendon. He's a beast. They got to keep feeding him. Doesn't make any sense to not utilize your top player on offense. Pass to Williams. Money man Mike in the chat. What's going on, Mike? How you doing, buddy? Haven't seen you in a while. Hope you're doing all right. Yeah, I wish NCAA attend was still online as well. That'd be sick. Pass left side. Hicks has it. That's a first down for the Wolfpack. Moore is 5 of 13 with a pick, and they just keep throwing it. I, I don't understand it. Play action. Deep shot over the middle. Oh, he caught that. No way. What a play. Wow. That's crazy that he just caught that. Deflected, he got hit, still hung on to it. Awesome play. And they have three rushing yards. What are you doing? McLennan is literally one of the best players in college football right now. And I think that's his second carry of the game that he just got. Oh, nice catch again for Hall. First down. He got wrecked at the end of that one. But Hall, three catches, 71 yards in the first half. Yeah, the only people that have died from that virus are, like, over, like, 70 years old. <laughs> I don't even know who that ball was to. There was three receivers in the same spot. Deep 
Shot left side, almost picked off by Longany. Oh my goodness. Shot, and that's Hall again. We can't guard this guy. <laughs> Nothing is too soon on the internet. <laughs> that's true. Get him. Okay, so their backup running back has more yards than their Heisman hopeful. This offense doesn't make any sense to me at all. Come on, let's stop him. Two minutes left in the half. to McClendon. He's still up and finally dropped at the five yard line first and go for the Wolfpack. Paul's playing really well. So hard to contain him. Yeah, it is, man. It, I don't know what, it's, what it is, but we just cannot seem to get a guy on him and stop him. I think he's at 100 yards receiving now. He's been their star player, not their halfback, which is who I thought would be. Oh, no, I played it perfectly. I just missed. No. Man. That should have been a pick. Feels bad. I knew exactly where that ball was going. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we almost got in there and blocked it. Okay, then. 14 to 7. We got ourselves a ball game, folks. All right, Pollock. Jarwarski Pollock. The speedster. And he did not get very far. All right. Let's see what we can do here to respond to that touchdown. All right, we'll take that. Been running a little bit more tonight than usual. But it's been working for us. Clear out that left side with Mason, and Mitchell's wide open. They cannot guard him. And Jukes can't get out of bounds. All right. They can't uh, play defense on the left side of the field, apparently. All right, let's do a couple deep outs here and a nice deep post. Oh, boy. Yep, that happened. Manny Lawson on the sack. That's unfortunate. Got him. Oh, nice deflection. Oh, my goodness. All right, third down and 18. See what we can do here. We got our number two half back in here. And he's actually open and he ran to the inside. Oh my goodness. That looks like we're gonna punt the football away here. We're just over a minute left in the half. Huber, 
Out for the kick. Oh, I, I ran it. That's that's not bad. Not good. It's real bad. <laughs> it feels bad. Oh man, that is unfortunate. I wanted to get a big hit right there. All right, less than a minute now. They look like they're just gonna just keep it on the ground. And they will go with an option play here. And McClendon gets taken down by the freshman. Great tackle by Alex Russell. Deep shot, wide open. Oh, and he dropped it. Oh my goodness. Just let your quarterback down, bud. Zach Pryor in the chat. What's going on, Zach? How you doing, buddy? Good old Silver Mania. I think we're all doing just fine, bud. Hopefully you're doing all right. And we get the stop. Let's go. Very tough, hard-fought game right now. Lysol wipes for 74 bucks. Wow, it ain't that serious, my guy. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Can you get that block for me? Can you get that? Can... Really, guys? There's two of you, one of him, and that's what you get for tackling me. I mean, I hope you're okay. All right. What do we got? 23 seconds, two timeouts left. You know some crazy rich lady's gonna buy those Lysol wipes, 100%. What a block right there, oh my goodness. All right, that was basically a worthless play right there. Feels bad. Wide open. Oh, we throw another pick. No. <laughs> oh, man. This is a tough game. Two interceptions tonight for Darian Durant. That doubles his total for the season. Insane. I sure will be able to play the national championship game. <laughs> Will they? Oh, the pick! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Go, Russell! Run! <laughs> Run! Yes! Yes! That was amazing! Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! Woo! <laughs> yeah! Put that on a highlight reel. That's why you run the clock? Listen, Mike, I just had a nice 93 yard pick six, baby. Let's go. That's how you end a half, son. I missed that extra point. I missed it. I made it. I barely made that. Wow. The freshman with his fourth interception on the season and his first career pick six. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Let's go. Jacques Lewis on for the return. The blockers just go so slow. It's insane. Where they rank now? Uh, NC State, I believe they're ranked ninth. We're 14th. I don't know how I made that extra point. Don't ask, all right? <laughs> I 
Oh boy. We haven't really been able to run the football except for with Darian Durant tonight. It's really unfortunate. This game is living up to the hype. Yes, sir. Marcus Hudson out four weeks of broken ribs. Feels bad. Oh boy. I see him. I see him. Oh, he got wrecked. Oh, man. Let's go. Huge play, though. Don't forget to slap that like button if you haven't already, folks. I'd be much obliged. Uh-oh. Mason had a step on that corner, too. I just had no time to throw it. I'm still hyped from that pick six. That was nuts. All right, Lewis, get it up past the 50. I like it. Oh, boy. I have like five unread messages on Discord right now. Gotta love it. Didn't know NC State was that good. Yeah, the running back is uh, the number one Heisman person right now. First down. Durant, last stream, only had two incompletions tonight. Seven with two picks. Come on, Mikey. Why you do this? Get off the field. Terrible. I don't care if you got six touchdowns. I'll bench you. Stop fumbling the football. Oh, man. He shot right side. There's Hicks. First down. Nice reception. As the Wolfpack are already... Into Tar Heel territory. We need to get some pressure on this quarterback. It's unreal how little bit of pressure that we've gotten so far this season. I think we have, what, four or five sacks? It's not enough. I'd like to get, you know, one or two sacks at least every game. You know, preferably two. <laughs> two would be good every game. All right, what you gonna do? Deep shot right side, wide open is Washington, and I get him out of bounds. Nice route. I don't think the coronavirus will last all the way until football season. It'll go away soon enough. No, oh, wide open is Hicks for the touchdown. And Wolfpack get it back within one score here in Chapel Hill. drive after that Mike Mason fumble made me extremely sad what is that kick I still want it though I still okay I guess I don't want it let's do it from the 35 Wide open. Pilek for the first down. I love those quick strikes. Just snap it and sling it.
Pollock, 42 yards tonight. Lewis is open now. Oh, okay. Just runs over the free safety leg. It's nothing. All right, we got to get Lewis off the field. He's a little bit tired. I love throwing the football in this game. It's so much fun. Really? Why don't you throw it a little bit slower, Durant? My goodness. Any other time, he slings it in there in like 0.1 seconds. Good pass. Oh! Fits it into that tight space. No lube. No lube. First down and 10 from the 34-yard line now. After that precision pass. Bowman, oh, nice deflection at the line. Bowman was wide open. That's unfortunate. Okay, Lewis, nine yard carry. He's got 32 yards tonight. Uh, just six touches, but he keeps getting really tired. Keep having to get him off the field, unfortunately. What do we got here? Bowman's wide open. First down inside the red zone. Carries wide open. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was the second time we missed him just like that. How? It's wide open. Oh, boy. That's a sack. Can't get rid of that one. Steven Tulloch on the sack. Third down and 16 now. We are in field goal range for our freshman kicker. Or we can hit Mitchell open over the middle for the first down and goal. Let's go. Beautiful throw. Beautiful route, beautiful catch. Just beautiful. Mitchell inside the five yard line. All right, let's see what you got, Lewis, from the four. 11 plays, 61 yard drive, almost three minutes off the clock. Okay, then. And Lewis finds the pylon or the end zone. He gets over the goal line. You know what I'm saying. Touchdown, Tar Heels. And that will extend the lead to two touchdowns yet again. Hunt on for another extra point. It's up and it is good. 12 plays, 65 yards, 301 off the clock. You love to see it. That's right, Michael. You love to see it. I'm still perplexed as to why the Wolfpack are not using their running back this game. It's blowing my mind. Get him. For 
the way their quarterback's been playing, I just I don't see them coming back unless they can get a little bit of a ground game work in here. I mean, he's made some good throws, but he's missed a lot of wide open targets. And they will keep it on the ground here. McClendon, nice tackle by Russell. His fourth tackle of the night. He has been a great addition to our secondary. And that is going to end the third quarter, folks. Get your fours up in the chat. Can we hang on and remain undefeated? Can we get to 5-0? and Can we get into the top ten? Let's go. Let's see what they got going here. Deep shot, man is open, and again he misses his target. Overthrows him. Brings up third down and four from their own 27-yard line. Oh, Russell with the clutch deflection. Let's go. Yes. That was beautiful. You'll love to see it. Fourth down. If we can pull this win off in this game, we will already have as many wins this season as we did last season. Lewis, you want to pick the ball up? What? What was that? What? What was that? What just happened? It literally would not give me any type of animation to pick the ball up or dive on it. You gotta love that Heisman cheese sometimes. You gotta love it. Deep shot to the end zone. Overthrows his target again. Typical Phillip Rivers. It's, <laughs> it's not Phillip Rivers though. Phillip Rivers got drafted by, what, the Giants? Is that the Giants? I can't remember where he went. That's only McLennan's sixth carry of the game. What are they doing? That doesn't make any sense to me at all. He had like 20-something carries against us last season. They just kept feeding him the ball and we couldn't stop him. Deep shot to the end zone, deflected away. Let's go. All right, they're gonna go for it, obviously. They need a touchdown here. What up, Topsy? What's going on, man? How you been, buddy? Oh, wide open is Hall. Oh, he fumbles it. We got one. And I got greedy. <laughs> Returned it out to the one-yard line. I'm sorry. I got way too excited on the fumble recovery. It's our first of the season. Let's go. You know I'm going to run it right here. Just Wow. Look at how almost in the end zone we are. Get out of the end zone. We're breaking a tackle. I like it. All right, second down and four now from the six. Gives us a little bit of breathing room. Wide open is Pollock running across the field up past the 30 yard line. So many turnovers in this game. Seven. 
That's nuts. Look at those numbers for Durant. Doubled his picks on the season just in this game. But 16 touchdowns over 1,300 passing yards. He has been on fire. Okay, he's stuffed up the line. You'd love to see it. You really do. All right, let's take off. Why not? He's got 37 yards tonight. Pretty good day for the quarterback on the ground. Let's go, Lewis. First down. Keep the clock moving. Move the chains. New set of downs. You got to love it. And Lewis is exhausted again. Only 36 rushing yards for NC State. I, I just don't get it. They've just been throwing it all game. Let's go, Pollock. You know, if I didn't run into my own tight end right there, <laughs> might have got some good yards. Instead, we lose six. Yo, what up, Marvin? Rivalry game action? Yes, sir. Been a lot of crazy plays in this game. Over the middle, Mitchell again. He has been on fire coming across the middle. Six catches, 74 yards, and a score tonight. Third down and four. Just over two minutes left in the ball game. Can we hang on? Can we finish strong? Wow, the answer is no. <laughs> My goodness. Zero blocking up front on the middle of that line. Wolfback call a timeout. 154 left in the ball game. All right, Huber. That was perfect. Let's go. Get there, Pollock. Oh! Pretty good kick. Love the backspin on it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what they're chanting, but I like it. What you got, more? Deep shot, and he had Hicks, but he was out of bounds. All right, second down and 10. Just got to hang on just a little bit longer. Over the middle is Williams, and he'll pick up nine yards. Defense. Defense. I love the sound of this game. It's amazing. Oh, I misplayed that one. Got him anyway. Hicks, player of the game for the Wolfpack. Russell, player of the game for the Tar Heels with that amazing interception return. Over the middle, incomplete drop yet again. Yo, what up, Jay Washington? I don't know if I gave you a shout-out earlier, but here it is. I love you. Thanks for stopping by, buddy.
I don't know why NC State played the game the way they did, but if they came out here with, you know, a ground attack, I think they would have played a lot better. But they've just been forcing the passing offense all game long, and I think it cost them this game. With the amount of turnovers that we had. Wow, what is that? Forces me to run towards the sideline. <laughs> well, with the amount of turnovers that we had, you know, they this game should be a lot closer than it is right now. And they might even have have the lead if they capitalized on our turnovers. But they just kept throwing it. Hall has been outstanding. Six catches, 122 yards. Goodness gracious. He did have a fumble, though, right at the goal line. All right, what do we got here? Let's go 5-2. Mix it up a little bit. Come on, snap the ball. You know you want to. Over the middle, Moyer. Nice spin move by the tight end. And first down inside the 15-yard line. Okay, then. That was a great play by the tight end. Linebacker almost fell on his face. I mean, he still made the tackle down the field, but still. He got shooketh. Shooketh, my friend. And they are going to spike this ball. 38 seconds left on the clock. They're just trying to preserve their last timeout that they have. Stick around for our second game of the doubleheader as we take on the ranked Virginia Cavaliers. They are also undefeated at this time. Over the middle, deflected. Great play. Let's go, baby. All right, third down and 10. From the 12. Cheeks clapped. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, nice hit on the quarterback. We're getting some pressure. It just took us the entire game. And it looks like maybe the 5-2 is the way to go if we want to get some pressure on the quarterbacks. Let's go with the prevent. Let's get it. We got to get to the one-yard line. It's the end zone. Caught and dropped. We get the stop. Let's go. This is going to be a huge win. I don't think Virginia's ready for what they got coming to them. And Lewis... Forces them to call their final timeout. And we are going to kneel it and get out of here with that dub. Over our rival, the NC State Wolfpack. Their Heisman hopeful McClendon got six carries for 22 yards. Why? I, I just don't understand that. They did have over 300 yards of offense, so did we. We had 380. Both passing attacks were doing pretty decent. If only their quarterback was a little bit more accurate, you know, he would have also went over 300 yards. But we get to dub 28-14. We are 5-0. We only won five games all last season. We are one win away from becoming bowl eligible here in year two of our North Carolina Tar Heels dynasty. My goodness. I did not expect this performance at all this season. I thought we were for sure going to lose to Florida State. And I thought we were for sure going to lose to NC State this season. Big time. But, you know, we beat Florida State by, what, a touchdown? And now we beat NC State by two touchdowns. They ran the ball nine times. They threw 43 passes. That is just mind-blowing to me. I don't get it. Somebody go back and watch our game against NC State last season. Tell me how, how many times McClendon ran the ball 
and how many yards and touchdowns he had. Because I guarantee you it was quite a bit. 93-yard pick six for Alex Russell. UNC coming for that number one spot. I don't know about all that. <laughs> Durant, one touchdown, two picks tonight. A little rough for him. But almost 300 yards passing, 67% sack twice. He also had 35 yards on the ground with a touchdown. Jack Lewis with a touchdown, 50 yards. Mitchell had the touchdown reception. One drop from Mike Mason and a fumble tonight. A little bit of a rough patch for him. Russell, Gerald Ferguson, and Jeff Longany with five tackles apiece. No tackles for a loss tonight, no sacks. We had two picks, though, by the safeties. And five pass deflections. Forced fumble for Demetri Kirk. And recovered by Cedric Holt. No field goals, two punts. Doubled his punt total on the season. All right, let's go take on the currently undefeated and ranked in the top 25, or the top 15 at least, I believe, the Virginia Cavaliers. Should be a very interesting game. I can't remember if we beat them last year. I know it was a really low-scoring affair, and we either pulled off a close upset or we lost it in the last second. I can't remember the final outcome of that game. If anybody else remembers, please let me know. And we just hit the 20 viewer mark on this stream. Appreciate everybody stopping by. Join our Discord if you haven't already. There's a link in the description below. Subscribe if you're new. Appreciate any kind of support you guys can give me. Slap a like on the video while we wait for this week six to simulate. Miami and Pittsburgh, USC, all win. Those are all top five schools. Iowa beats Michigan State by a point. We are number 11 in the nation. Traveling to take on the 10th ranked Virginia Cavaliers. 5-0 versus 4-0. Let's look at the matchup. I don't really pay attention to the, the ratings up top. I pay attention to the rankings down below. And our defense is number 9 in the country right now. Virginia's is 15. And the pass defense is 9. So that could be definitely something to look out for. They don't allow a lot of passing yards. Their secondary has got to be pretty good. But we do have the number 5 passing offense. Over 300 yards per game. And we're so much better at running the football this season. I know where it says we're, we're 83rd in the nation, but... We were nowhere even close to getting 100 yards rushing per game last season. All right, let's do this. Miami smokes West Virginia. Not even close. Oklahoma wins, USC wins. All whites, baby. Let's get icy up in here. Let's go. And we are without Mo Ivy for one more game. This is a huge game right now. The last one was huge too, but this, we could potentially be in the top five after a win tonight against Virginia, if we could pull this off. They basically have the same exact offense with Martinez at quarterback. He was pretty good last season. I believe he was the backup last year, and the starting quarterback got hurt, which I believe was Matt Schaub. And Martinez came in and played pretty well for them. All right, we're going to get the ball to start the second half. Expect this crowd to be pretty raucous here tonight. Lundy, I believe he was in the Heisman voting as well. Let's see what they come out and do on offense. Let's go Russell, freshman phenom at strong safety. Deep shot, left side, almost picked off on the first play. Oh my goodness. Not a good start for Martinez. What are you doing, my guy?
Shout out to Michael Gregory for joining the Discord. Welcome, my friend. Appreciate you joining. All right, third down and eight already. I'm going to expect a pass right near the sticks on this play. And he goes out of bounds before the marker. And we get the stop. A three and out to start. And they are getting booed hardcore right now. You'll love to see it. All right, Hagen on for the punt. Jacques Lewis back to return. And he gets dropped pretty quickly. All right, offense. Let's see if we can perform a little bit better than last game with, you know, without the two interceptions and a fumble. My goodness. Defensive line just collapsed our offensive line. Let's go, Durant. First down. He left the middle of the field wide open on that option play. Greer open. Freshman tight end comes down with it at the 26-yard line. First down, Tar Heels. Let's go, baby. We're coming for the ACC. We got this. And open over the middle is Carey, the number two halfback. And that is the first down inside the 15-yard line now. Let's go with a couple little curl routes here on the insides. Mitchell's wide open. What are they doing? They can't, they cannot cover him on the inside like that. And Lewis. Oh, he's so close. Dropped at the one. Mitchell, oh my goodness. Touchdown Tar Heels. Wow. The PGA is canceling the events. That's all right. If I want to fall asleep, I'll put on some country music. Really good drive to start the game for us. <laughs> golf sucks. <laughs> I used to love playing the Tiger Woods golf games for the PS2. I might actually get one. Put it on the channel. Make the goofiest look at golfer I can. I don't know if any of you guys are into tennis, but I do have a tennis game on the PS3 that I could potentially put on the channel. Might bring some different kind of viewership to the channel. You don't really see many people playing tennis on YouTube. Might be fun. I'm actually pretty decent at the game, too. 
Martinez deep shot left side almost picked off oh my goodness what are you doing are they really just not gonna run the football just like the Wolfpack I, I just don't I don't get it I don't get it get him get out of here All right, third down and 12. Just seven yards of offense so far. Oh, my. Deep shot. Left side, and it's caught by Heath Miller for the first down. Golf is more interesting to you in video game form than actually watching on TV. Yeah, I'm the same way, man. Same way. Just like with that tennis game that I have. It's so interesting to me to play. But to sit and watch it on TV, I can't. Oh boy, he almost hung out of that. They're going to run it. Oh, my goodness. They keep running straight into the defensive lineman, though. Like, our D-line is not that great. They just keep running right into the defenders. Like, we're not breaking any blocks to get to these running backs at all. If you watch our defensive line, we're just getting stood up. Or pancaked like our defensive end was right there. Two of six, 40 yards. Wow. And it looks like I'm going to go with safe return here. I did this. I did a safe return against Virginia Tech. Or a safe block, actually, because they were faking a field goal. And they got a touchdown anyway. Okay, touchback. You watch Serena Williams running around jiggling those assets? <laughs> Who wouldn't, man? Come on now. She got all sorts of junk in that trunk. You'd love to see it. Shout out to Elijah Jackson in the chat. I should <laughs> use Ask Corso. All right, I'll do it for the rest of this drive for you, buddy. All right, let's see what he wants to do. Out attack. Let's get it. Looks interesting. Oh boy. Okay, just dive. <laughs> oh my goodness. What was the score of the last game? 28-14. We were able to secure the dub. Play action corner out of the Ask Corso catalog. Should be fun. I don't know what just happened right there, but he's wide open. Let's go, Bowman, to the 45-yard line. Five consecutive completions. Now we're going to go safety delight. I can't remember the last time I just spammed the Ask Corso button on on offense. <laughs> it's been a while. Who wants it? All right, Mason. We got so many receivers that are so good. Like, you know, you have to just pick and choose which one you want to try to cover. It's so hard for secondaries to do that. This should be interesting. I'm kind of scared. Design quarterback run. Pray for me. Yep, just going to dive. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Every single ass Corso play has worked pretty well so far. Double flag. Let's go. Bowman, perhaps, on the corner route. Nope. Got to hit Mitchell. Seven straight completions. Wow. 
tunnel screens. I uh, can't remember the last time I ran a tunnel screen play. This could be disastrous. Quick pass, Pollock, and a first down. Okay, that'll be, <laughs> that'll be the end of the first quarter. Durant ends on an eighth consecutive completion in a row streak. Wow. Mason's going to be a force for his college career? Yes, sir. He's got at least one more year after this before he goes pro. We might have to draft him for the Falcons. Oh, he's wide open. Aw. I thought that ball was going to go out a lot farther than that. Ahmad Brooks on the tackle. His fifth fifth of the ball game. Tunnel screens again? Okay, then. And Pollock picks up a couple yards. Ten straight completions. Crazy. We still don't even have 100 yards either. Just little dink and dunk passes. But it's working for us. We're getting down the field, you know. All right, we scored a touchdown with Mitchell on this play before. And he's wide open, but I couldn't throw it. It wouldn't let me throw it. Was that a high snap? I didn't even see it. Might have been a high snap that affected the play. I literally was just looking at Mitchell the entire time that play was going. That should have been an easy touchdown. Instead, the freshman kicker gets to come on for his third career attempt. And I watched the replay back. It was a high snap. Feels bad. Hunt. His field goal is good. And it's 10 to nothing. Nice 11 play, 62 yard drive. 308 off the clock for the Tar Heels. Oh, that was not a good kick. Come on, bounce to the left. Oh, he touched it. Aw. Doesn't count because he didn't catch it. That's all right. They can have it at the 35. It's fine. Oh, they're going to go reverse on us. Got him. Nice run, though. Hagens picks up about six or seven. No! <laughs> oh! Oh, boy. That is extremely unfortunate. I hope he's okay. So I don't know who Richardson is, but I don't like him already. His name's too long. Oh, boy. Russell gets hurt, and they just instantly start throwing it in that exact spot where Russell's supposed to be. Russell on track to be a freshman All-American with the stats he's putting up. Nice run by Lundy. And Richardson filling in for Russell has made two straight tackles. And that was a big one. Lundy could have been still running. We lose one player, and now their offense is just going to be lights out. The man got a migraine from a hit. Oh, boy. Oh, come on. Russell would have made that pick. He would have. Richardson's too short. Appreciate it, Aaron. Thanks for the heads up, buddy. That's right side, Heath Miller. And he'll pick up four or five yards. Is that a big loss? Yes, Tyler. That is a big loss. Russell is a beast. There we go, he's back. Man is a warrior. Playing with a migraine. I wouldn't wish that on anybody. I've done it. It's terrible. Don't ever do it. <laughs> What do you got? What do you got? Deep shot. Nope. Quick pass to Stuper. First down. Martinez now 6 of 10. 75 yards. Durant 10 of 10. 92 yards and a touchdown. He has been so good for us this season. It's really helped that he stayed healthy. 
I think if we stayed healthy all last season, um, our record would have been a lot better than what it was. Get him! Get him! And another injury. Chase Page, one of our defensive linemen, injured his head on the play. Oh, my goodness. Why Why you do this? All right, let's see what we got here. In the end zone, hit him in the back. Wasn't ready for the pass. All right, let's put a couple linebackers here on third down and five. And Martinez to the left, wide open is Nicholson. And I don't think he got it. He didn't. Huge stop. And they're going to go for it. This is a huge play. Crowd going crazy right now. And they're going to go counter. Get, oh, what a spin by Lundy. And he almost made it into the end zone if he didn't trip. He already has as many carries as T.A. McClendon had last game for NC State. Virginia is not playing around. And that is a touchdown for Martinez, little quarterback sneak. And the Cavaliers on the board to make it a 6-10 game. That was a great drive. Best drive we've seen against the Tar Heels defense in a couple games. And it is now 10 to 7. Number 11 Tar Heels on top of the number 10 the Virginia Cavaliers. Let's play 65 yard drive. We got less than two minutes left here in the half to get something going downfield. Dude needs ankle insurance. Let me make fun of my players, bruh. Let's go, Pollock. Let's go, Pollock. Let's go, Pollock. He's so shifty. Wow, uh, their fight song about to put me to sleep. Seriously, make it stop. Oh, I shouldn't have slowed down right there. Made the first guy whiff, though. That was nice. All right. What do we got? Wide open. Greer, the tight end. Greer's still going. Greer down to the 31-yard line. Okay, then. You just swear at me, Tyler? I don't know what you just said, buddy. But I almost had an aneurysm trying to read what you just said. Uh-oh. Just gonna take off, get a few yards out of that. Go out of bounds safely. I don't want the smoke. I don't want it. Oh boy. Bowman. Oh, down inside the five yard line. <laughs> His momentum carried him. I couldn't, you know, make him stop and then try to make a play. All right, what are we doing here? What do I want to do? Quick pass. Oh, he overthrows him. He was wide open. Oh, 
man. Trying to get the young freshman his first career touchdown. Unless I got him one earlier. I don't remember. There's his touchdown. Let's go. He was wide open. Great drive. Left 38 seconds on the clock, though. And it's 17 to 7. Let's go. Team is playing out of their minds this season. I guarantee we're going to lose to some crap school that is, is having a terrible season. It's bound to happen. Get him. I just fell right down on my face. Lundy breaking another tackle. He's still up. This guy's a beast. They got to use him more. If we had a really good running back, I would definitely give him like 15 carries a game. Right now, Lewis only gets, I don't know, maybe 10 if he's lucky. So our passing attack is just so potent. Are they going to snap the ball one more time or what? What you going to do, suckers? They're going to go with a screen pass. And Martinez is going to be sacked. And that's how the first half ends. We are on top 17-7 to as we get our fifth sack of the season. And we get the ball. Let's go, Jacques. Oh, come on. All right, Michael, take it easy, bro. Oh, boy. Don't worry, guys. I saw him. Oh, almost a fantastic spin move. That would have been sick if he was able to get past that last guy. The state motto is Virginia is for lovers, but after this game it'll be Virginia is for losers. So hurtful. <laughs> but I like it. Yes, sir. See you in the Discord, Mike. Appreciate it, buddy. Who wants it? Nobody. Just gonna take off. All right, second out of five. I'll, I'll be on the Discord right after this game. Can't do it both at the same time because my computer will explode. And it's right by my legs, so I, I don't want that. Oh, Pollock with a catch! <laughs> oh my goodness! Great diving, full extension catch. From Jaworski Pollock. Nicholas Hall in the chat. What's going on, Nick? Appreciate you stopping by, buddy. Durant 15 of 16 in this ball game. Gary's wide open. That's the number two halfback. Nice catch and run. 13 first downs. And that's what our offense has really been doing very well this season. Is just keep on moving the chains, slow methodical drives. We've done some deep passes that have connected, but for the most part it's been short to mid-game passing. I'm a effing problem. What's going on, bro? How you doing, buddy?
Mitchell wide open. I don't know what they do on these routes, but they just don't have anybody in the middle of the field. Just exposing them right now. Just grinding away to that 1,000 subscriber mark, bro. You know how it is. Just keep on grinding. Who wants it? Mitchell. Oh, he got it again inside the five. Let's go. The defender was all over him. That was one heck of a catch. First and goal from the three-yard line, trying to make this a three-score ball game. And Lewis walks in for the touchdown, his first of the game. Let's go. Team is just on fire. Started with that Florida State game. You know, we had that big upset win. And then, I mean, we just carried that momentum every single week. And I have been thoroughly enjoying this. Being able to put up some points on offense, you know, have a bunch of yards. Our defense is playing really well. A couple of big plays here and there, but nothing too crazy. The occasional really long drive. Oh boy. You're almost a thousand subs. Yeah, we're at 915 right now, Tyler. You're going to go back and watch that Apex clip again? Yeah, buddy. Triple kill with the Kraber, bruh. Oh, boy. Toss play. Watch out. Watch out for Lundy. Oh, good lord. Oh, my goodness. Woo. There we go. It's good to see him actually use their top player. <laughs> you know, I, I don't mention it much, but if you guys want or have a Twitter, you can go follow me on Twitter as well. Link to that is in the description below, just like the Discord link is in the description. I think I got like 120 followers or something. Nothing too crazy. Okay, now they're just gonna pound the rock, huh? I scored in the third with 3.33 left. <laughs> I honestly didn't even notice that. All right, third down and four. They're gonna come out in the goal line set here. I'm gonna go 3-4 and blitz three of our linebackers. See what happens. go the fullback and he is dropped not a very good play call Lundy's been having some pretty decent runs this drive and you just give it off to the fullback like, why that doesn't make any sense to me at all Hagen on for the punt Jacques Lewis back to return come on Jacques couldn't quite get past the fatty. I think that was the fullback. <laughs> Alright. Let's see what we can do here. Oh boy. Greer! Freshman tight end! He's got it! Inside the 35-yard line. And he is up over 100 yards receiving... For the first time in his young career. Let's go. Took the young tight end five games, or five and a half games rather, to get 100 yards in a game. Quick pass, left side, Bowman. And he accelerates for about nine or ten yards. It's now eight consecutive completions for Durant. 
Dink and dunk, man. That's how you gotta win sometimes. Illuminati confirmed. You guys are wild. <laughs> Bowman. Open. Bowman accelerates. And he goes untouched for the touchdown. Oh my goodness. Did you see the burst from the young man? No way that I think he was going to score after he caught that. That's crazy. And we got the young three score lead here in the third now. Kind of going away with it here. A little bit. And it's 31 to 7. I love this offense, man. It's so crazy. Just have so many weapons to throw to. We'll have even more once Mo Ivy comes back. Even the Virginia mascot is disappointed. <laughs> Wouldn't you be? Your team's losing by 24 in the third quarter. You were undefeated. You're about to take that big fat L. Reverse, yet again. And this time it goes nowhere. I believe they got like eight yards on it last time. And Martinez is sacked again. That is our second sack of the ball game. I said I wanted to get more pressure on the quarterbacks, and we have in this game. That's going to make it third and 15. And we kind of did this last season to Virginia. It was a very low scoring game. Uh oh. Who's tackling? That'll bring up fourth down again. But I don't remember. I don't think Virginia had a whole lot of yards last season against us. Think we can go undefeated? I don't know, man. ACC is tough. Especially if we have to face Clemson again, because they absolutely destroyed us last season. I think they put up 50 on us. Lewis back to return from the 33-yard line. And a nice juke gets to the outside. Lewis out of bounds inside the 40-yard line. Get your fours up, folks. That was the final play of the third quarter. We're on top 31-7 to here against the 10th-ranked Virginia Cavaliers. Offense is a lot of fun to watch. You never know who's going to break one. I know. It's crazy. I can throw it up to anybody. Like, they're all capable. Like, look at this. Greer. Oh, no. He fumbled. We got it. No, he fumbled again. Oh, my goodness. That was one of the weirdest plays I've ever seen in my life. Feels bad. But Destin on the recovery. Oh, it's terrible. Durant just went over 300 yards passing as well. Let's close it out for win number six. I'm trying. Oh, that should have been a pick. Come on. They're going to get me for pass interference, too. I was all over him. I'll admit that. Harold Beecher, head coach of the Tar Heels, yelling at the referee on the sideline. Doesn't like the call. <laughs> Double fumble. Yeah, it's happened a couple times on the channel. Not very often. It's a rare occurrence. They're going to go quarterback draw here. Martinez is dropped for a loss. Down 24. And you're going to do a quarterback draw with a pocket passing quarterback. Totally makes sense. Stick around after this game to see who we're going to face in our next stream, which will be Sunday night. And there's Nicholson. Nice pass. And 
they finally go over 100 yards passing for the ball game. And Martinez is sacked again. Our third sack of the game. Oh my goodness. I don't even know who that guy was. Number 80. That's our right defensive end. Let's go see what his name is. Davis. Okay, then. I see you, Davis. Martinez thrown over the middle, overthrows his target. That's going to bring up a fat third down and 19. You'll love to see. Yeah, let's see where you go. Oh, wide open. Where is the coverage? What is this? I don't know what that was. Besides terrible, I, I just don't know. And they're going to run it. Wally Lundy, he picks up a handful of yards there. Cavaliers not done yet. They're still fighting. They're going to hand it out to Lundy again, and he falls forward. He gets the first down. He's 37 rushing yards tonight. I would be feeding him all game. He's so good. Toss play, Lundy. Oh, he's too fast. Nice tackle. Let's go. He just got away from my dive attempt with Russell. All right, I got the tight end. He's Miller. They're going to toss it out to Lundy. And he's in. Nice tackle. Just couldn't get him down in time. So they're going to close the gap just a little bit here. They finally feed it to their All-American halfback. About to be... Oh, they're going to go for two, so let's see what happens here. If they can get it, it'll be a two-score ball game. They'll just have to get two touchdowns with two two-point conversions. Wide open on the right. What am I doing? Oh, we got the sack again! Oh, my goodness! So it remains a three-score ball game. Let's go! Just all over this quarterback. Wow. Might not have a lot of yards, but he's still running people over. Yeah, he's so good. I, don't, I just don't understand what's happening with the ground attack for the past couple games. And what was that? Nice catch, though. This is a linebacker on the recovery, by the way. And a great return. You love to see it. You just got to. Lewis. And that's five yard carry for Jacques Lewis. He has had a rough game as well. Well, Lundy averaging almost four yards per carry. He's doing pretty well. They just need to give him more rushes. That's what I'm saying. You got to just keep handing him the ball. If I had an All American running back, you best believe they'd be getting 15 to 20 carries per game. Absolutely. But Jacques Lewis, not an All American. He just ain't on that level. Don't get me wrong, though. He's made some nice plays this season so far, but if he was a little bit more athletic, he would be fantastic. 76% on third downs this season. Unreal stat. Big one here. Third down three. Two minutes to go in the ball game against number 10, Virginia. 
Pollock wide open, and Pollock is gone. <laughs> Let's go. They had both safeties blitz on the play. And they were doomed. As soon as he came across the middle, there's no way anybody was going to catch him. Wow. Jarwarski Pollock, our resident short stuff, <laughs> with the touchdown reception. Instead, the computer wants to continuously overthrow their receivers. I know, it just doesn't make any sense what their offenses are doing. Like, it's not, they didn't do this last season. Like, sure, there was overthrows, but they, if a team had a good running back last season, they were utilizing that. And they were making us pay the entire game. That's why we got blown out so many times. Got blown out by NC State. Blown out by Clemson. Uh, who else? Who, who else would get blown out by? Maryland, I believe. Put up like 60-something on us, I think. Something crazy. Some insane number. 38-13 here in the fourth. Uh-oh. He's got the edge. Get him. Get him. <laughs> nice return. And it's not like our team got, like, just, you know, infinitely better. Like, we just recruited, like, ten All-Americans. Like, that's not what happened at all. I just... I mean, we got some more youth on the defense, for sure. We've always had these targets. On offense, there's another pick for Alex Russell, the user. Let's go. Like, definitely the addition of Russell was huge for the secondary, for sure. I don't know, maybe the change to the defense is the fact that I'm using a safety this season instead of uh, a middle linebacker, which is what I did last year. I don't know. I don't know if that would really affect the game that much more, though. Oh, nice tackle. Texas rolling Kansas State. 37 nothing in the third. Wow. Pass to Greer. And <laughs> Greer up inside Cavalier territory. Six catches, 132 yards for the freshman tight end. Breakout performance for him. Lundy gets player of the game for Virginia. Durant player of the game for the Cat or for the Tar Heels, rather. Why why am I playing safety, Topsy? I love playing safety, man. It's so much fun. No! Oh my goodness. And there was a clipping. That, you, you know what you gotta do with it. You gotta love it. You got to. Unreal. Down by 25. Let's keep running it now. Totally makes sense. Great game plan. Who's their coach? Kyle Shanahan? And they're going to still keep running it. Oh my goodness. He just gave him the Mike Tyson jab to the face. And they got us for a face mask. Woof. That's what I'm saying. They just kept feeding him all game. He would eventually break a bunch of runs like that. And now they'll give it off to the fullback. Oh, man. Chip Kelly type coaching. <laughs> I like it. It's okay to run the football if you're losing. If you have the players that are capable of breaking big runs. You know? 
Uh oh. Nice throw. Oh my goodness. How did he not catch that? Look at Durant. 24 of 25? What? Oh my goodness. That dink and dunk offense is nuts. That's like, what was it Marshall, their quarterback, like four years ago or something? Was like 53 of 55 or something crazy. Like they just kept doing short passes all game. Illinois might upset Purdue. They're up 17-14 right now in the third. And Illinois has zero dubs on the season. Final play of the game. If they snap it, they will. Lundy on the carry. Can we get the stop? And we will. That is the final 38 to 13. We beat the number 10 Virginia Cavaliers. And you got to expect us to jump up into possibly the top five, maybe just the top eight. How do I stay motivated to play every day? Because I love football, man. I could play this all day every day and I would never get bored with it like you can ask my brother in the chat this is like all I play <laughs> I love football I loved it from the day I was born twas my first love All right, let's take a look at the stats, then we'll get out of here and take a look at our next two opponents for Sunday night's stream. Durant, 24 of 25 with four touchdowns. My guy. What? <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's insane. Man, we had no punts again. Passing attack, just too much for Virginia. Imagine if we had a great running back to go along with this passing attack. Imagine. 24, 25, 361, four touchdown, 96%. Wow. And he had 36 yards rushing, which led the team. Fumble for Lewis. Four touchdowns, all to different players. And Jamal Greer, breakout performance from him. And did Mike Mason have a catch? He had one catch. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. We didn't need him. Greer stepped up. And no drops. I like it. Kirk, free safety, seven tackles. We had three sacks today. It's a season high, I believe. It's got to be. Russell with another pick. Only one tackle, though. Two deflections for Holt. And Hunt, one of one field goals. Five of five extra points. And a 29-yard punt return by Jacques Lewis. I'm glad you found the channel as well, Topsy. Alright, let's see what we got. No, I don't care about this. Get out of here. I do want to see this score, though. Really? How? You guys have DeMarcus Ware and OCU Minora. What are you doing? Unless they got drafted. No, I don't think so. Pretty sure DeMarcus Ware is still there. And Georgia just lost to unranked Alabama. That's their first loss of the year. Yeah, love to see it. Wait. Oh, I wanted to stop the simulation. Did I stop it? I don't think I did. I want to go and take a look at the... Whoops. The archive cover. I don't know if we were on it or not. Hey, we were. Russell and North Carolina knock off ACC opponent NC State. Awesome. I'm shocked that we're not here. I mean, it makes sense that Alabama would be on there. Or Georgia, rather. All right, but uh, let's see. We are now ranked number nine. So we only moved up two spots with that win. What? Get out of here. All right, let's simulate our bye week. And then we'll check out our opponents. NC State 1. 
UAB lost. That's their second loss of the season. That'll hurt Roddy White's chances at a Heisman. Miami barely beats Florida State. 39-34. Great rivalry. You have to love that game. That is my fifth favorite rivalry game, actually. All right. Missouri beats Nebraska. And we are now number six in the nation. We're already bowl eligible. But we have a tough matchup coming up as we travel into the Autzen Zoo to take on the Oregon Ducks. Yes, they're ranked 50th. I don't care about that. Their offense, 32nd in the country, over 400 yards per game. And a pretty good rush defense. So, But their pass defense, I mean, that could spell disaster for the Ducks. I, I like our chances in that game, but I do think Oregon's going to play us pretty tough in that one. And then our next game is at home as we host the Clemson Tigers, who are 4-2 on the season. They destroyed us last year. And they are basically in the top 50 for all of their rankings. So should be a couple decent games on Sunday night. But that is going to be it for this one, folks. Again, appreciate everybody stopping by. Do the Heisman watch. We'll check that out uh, Sunday night, Tyler. All right, buddy? We'll check out all the Sports Illustrated stuff Sunday night before we get into our games, just like we did tonight for this one. But that is going to be it for this stream, folks. Hit that like button on your way out if you haven't already. Subscribe if you're new. Join the Discord community. The link is in the description below. That is it for me. I'll see y'all Sunday night with Oregon and Clemson. Till then, take it easy, guys.